Good to add more names. Underestimate a bit of good intel. What's inside? Better make sure we're well rested. Let's lay out the facts. I think we need to discuss this. You will come round for a second. Let's lay out the facts. Thank you. 
right, let's get going. Time's a wasting. Dig up some spongy spuds. Let's report back to Carson.
We only use beacon stones for emergencies. I hope nothing bad's happened. I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's go check. Sounds like a scoop. Can't underestimate a bit of good intel. Now to gather the offerings. The colony holds some deeply alien customs. What's inside? Huh. <gasps> Good thing we found this. Huh. Let's use this. This 
for something decent, right? slide down that thing. Is that...? <laughs> Everyone... I'm sorry. Slide down that thing. Oh, a container. Say, over there. to take the fast way. Ah. Woohoo! This gets the blood pumping, eh? We've so got to do that again! Hmm? Huh? What's that? I guess this is fate too, huh? has risen to greet us. I've never traveled so far from my colony before. You'll do just fine, Juniper. Let's go. Hmm? What's that? Oh, looks like we can go on from here.
use you and me on. You're dealing with me. Just watch. Let me get your tank. I'll bring you down. No questions. Kill it up. Out of the frying pan and into the fire. Kevez and Agnes are both fully mobilized. We're quite well traveled by now, huh? One at a time. Huh. <sighs> Good thing we found this. Whoa, what's with that one? Sliding down! Ah, we found rain. We found this. I'm curious to see what tactics you have in place surrounded by so much nature. What say we go hunting together? I'm fairly well versed in that.
Better make sure we're well rested. <sighs> I was getting kind of sleepy. I just saw you stuffing your cheeks. The rations should have been divided equally. Manana walked more than you used to today. Tommy was rumbly grumbly. Not much we can do, though. Not now. Manana, look, we've still got a ways to go. So you're going to have to get used to rationing stuff out, OK? Completely gone! <gasps> What's up? What's wrong? What did you say was gone? I think she was yelling about food. What? No way! For real! French sure did not just put elsewhere and forget. Nuh uh. I'm positive it was right here. Indeed. I checked it myself before I turned in. Don't tell me someone scoffed the whole lot. Ah, oh, no way. Mm -hmm. Nana will leave no plate unpolished. That awful, false accusation! Not even Manana ever stooped to such crude, vulgar behaviour. All right, all right, we get it. Just chill out already. Manana refused to become frosty. This is now a matter of honour and dignity. For starters... I know Manana was feeling a bit peckish, but she can't have eaten up the lot. So who then? Really, it wasn't Greek. That guy barely eats at all, right? Indeed. Greek can practice ancient knock-on art of restraint. Hey, check it. Manana, do not. A feather? But what kind? We can employ Manana I found traps here. Nobody's blaming you. These footprints. I think they're turkey. Mystery solved then. A turkin feather. So they raided our supplies. Lands can stop apology. Honor and dignity of Manana left in tatters from vile and baseless accusation. Come on, please lighten up already. All accusations aside, we're really strapped for food. Guess we'll have to go foraging. I can go. Luckily, this area is pretty bountiful all in all, so we might not be too hard-pressed. Well, better get to it. Right. Okay. Anyway, that clearly too much eat. Manana is bottomless pit. Meh meh? What? Well, how Riku know Manana is dainty eater? Not denying. Lies and deceit. On this day of days, Manana will have retribution! Looks like we've got ourselves a runner! Slipped out from the castle! Is this okay? He could get in touch with Ouroboros. Won't that impact our previous arrangements? Not to worry. If he does make contact, they'll come. <laughs> really? Ouroboros are simply like that. Hmm. Well, if you say so, we can probably take your word. Right, O? Hmm, certainly. As you say, P, we probably can take his word.
looking amazing. Guess we know what's on the menu today, then. You've picked a fight with the wrong people. I need you, Mia! Ah! Much relief. Glad Riku had just power frame last night. Should perform 30% better than leading brand. What's she on about, leading brand? I get that we're weaker than Agniant, so we need this to get on more of an even footing in combat, but... Friends say but. Why but? We just need oomph, you know, like kapow sort of thing. Sound effects not help comprehension. Oh, you know, like that doodad Noah has. Doodad? Ujima Flip. You know what I mean. Don't make me say it. What friend want to use for? Uh, well, I... Not on your own by any chance. Uh, if so, Riku have to pass. Oh, come on. So Riku gets right. Ugh. Backing up. This plan of Lance, know a privy to it? <sighs> Make decision without consult allies? Bad form. For he's our enemy. And who decide that? You're never say himself? That he enemy? He did. I did. In absence of complete picture? Well, but he's different. So after meet just once, Lance make up mind? <sighs> then... What are we gonna do? Only thing friends can. Keep moving forward. How's that gonna solve anything? Should never have asked. Also, do that, not that kind of thing. Uh... Hey, should we go check out the other side too? I'd better send them off. Uncharted territory always puts me on edge. Quite a rare sight. Hey, look! That's a really odd looking tree. Bright fig? What's a bright fig when it's at home? Let me guess. They're stupidly delish. Oh, guaranteed! Deliciousness is such that friends will be picking up jaws from ground for weeks! Uh-oh. What's up? Are they rotten or something? Tragedy strike! These not right for plucking! 
cooking yet, let alone eating. If eat now, bitter flavour cause agonising death. Huh? I don't know. They look tasty enough to me. Bright fig not good for eating even after full yellow. Still have to wait another year before able to enjoy. That's too long. Man, so much for that. Never mind. You can always come back next year. It's legendary, right? You wouldn't want to miss out. Guess we'll have to. But, Mio, a year from now? Mm. Even if I might not get to do it. You guys can still have a taste. Why wouldn't you... Whoa. Love, you've got to stop being so detached about it. You'll just get everyone feeling guilty. Oh, sorry, sorry. Please don't mind me. Don't mind me, she says. Of course we're going to mind you, doll. Hey, how can you be so casual about it? What do you mean, casual? I assure you, I'm not. I'm actually pretty flustered. You defo don't look it. If it looks that way to you, well, that's because I shouldn't even be here. What do you mean? This life's a gift from a dear friend. It should have been me. I should have died out there that day. So this isn't really me. I'm just living on her time. Maybe that's why. Hmm. Somehow, that reminds me of us. I know. When we're interlinked, I can see a glimpse. Inferno. Destruction. Land screaming. Noah's memories. What if... Bear with me. That friend of yours, she showed up like Euron. As an enemy? as an enemy. I suppose I'd want to know same as Lance. Simply why. Gotcha. I figured. Mm. Why is it that you gave your life for mine? Why? You could have lived longer yourself, me, Abby. Why did you do it? So her name was me, Abby. Sorry. I guess it's a sensitive subject. <laughs> it's funny. I thought I had it all locked down. Thank you. <sighs> Whatever a reason, I'd accept it. The facts. Whatever the truth may be. And that's it. No looking back. Well, my de facto partner's running full steam ahead. I mean, I can't very well go backwards, can I now? Your partner's now, eh? <laughs> I suppose you are at that. Hmm? I wonder, how does he see things? I think there's more food to find over there. Well, let's go find it. Hey. 
What's this food you're on about? Did you scoff it all up already? We couldn't even if we wanted to. something decent, right? We've rounded up plenty of ingredients. Looks tasty. Huh? This amount to keep Is us going for a while. Watch your footing, guys. Huh. These are worth a bit, right? Ugh. That smarts. Something so valuable here. Make use of this. Ugh, that smart. Whoa, what's with that one? All right, then. That should be us good for food now. Yeah. Looks like that'll last us a little while. <gasps> What's wrong, Mio? <gasps> Who's there? Come out! Huh? Boliaris! Much better. I owe you. What are you doing over this way? 
I thought you were going to the castle. Yeah. No, I went. And this is what I got for my trouble. So, tell us, what happened? But why, Your Majesty? Why would you attack Colony 4? You came into contact with Ouroboros, did you not? <gasps> I'd call it burning out the contagion. C contagion You're implying we've been contaminated? Have you not? You've been removed from the protection of the flame clocks. You no longer need to wager your lives in battle. Who struggles not in life deserves not to live. That is the compact of our nation, and moreover, the truth. Majesty, my queen. Yet, to punish you all for fate's machinations would be a misstep. Therefore, I shall grant you a chance. What must I do? Eliminate Ouroboros. <gasps> you want me to... Noah, and the rest. Naturally, I am cognizant of the fact that the enemy is wily and capable. I have no intention of sending you alone. <gasps> Kamaravi! Why, why are you here? Ethel. Uh, how? But you're not even on the same side. Entertainment. Pardon? Those who have been released from the Flame Clock's sacred indenture cannot be affected by the Mobius Iris. To bring you back under control, I would have to force your rebirth. But that wouldn't be nearly as fun. The power you two wield surpasses even some of our consoles. I have great hope for you. Ethel. Kamaravi. They gave Ethel and Kamaravi new phronises. They've been made specifically to kill Ouroboros. The tune-up might take a little while. Though, you don't have much time. The two of them are after your heads. You're sure of this? Really? That's why I came here. To give you warning. They already know your rough position. That's how I found you in the first place. What's this? Plans of the castle. They were tuning up my Pharonis when I happened upon them. They include schematics for the Annihilator. Take them and go back to Colony 4. Commander, you mean... If they can find us wherever we are, I want to at least secure a way for us to put up a fight. Am I wrong? <laughs> but, Mom, we can't very well. Also, about Noah's group. If you happen across them, tell them this. I will use lethal force, yes? What? Furthermore, tell them I wish them all the best of luck. I hope they reach their goal. Commander?
Ethel, she sounds serious. And still telling us to just keep going? Oh, well, that's Ethel for you. Hard-headed as they come. Won't she get into trouble because of you slipping out? Hardly. I'm just one missing foot soldier. No one's going to pay it any mind. Ah, huh? but your wounds earlier. Uh, truth is, air from falling off a cliff on the way here. It was dark as snuff. <laughs> Are you tucking my wings? Well, anyhow, it's nothing for you lot to fret over. This is our problem now. You focus on achieving your objective. We appreciate it. Ah, but man, you know, why's the commander got to duke out with you lot, eh? And why was our foe Kamaravi there, the Ashbar? Feels like the whole world's turned on its head. Alrighty, I'm heading back. Got it? You lot scoot on along out of these parts. There's still some time before they're done tweaking. And with you on foot... We're not running away. Not after all this. Huh? I'm staying too. What? Really? That light we saw a while back. If that... if that had come from the Annihilator... Even if we were to somehow reach our destination, if it was at the cost of all your lives, it wouldn't be worth it. <sighs> Surviving like that, I couldn't bear it. Mimi. Mia. Boliaris. The castle plans. Can you share them? Noah, uh, you're not... You wouldn't. The fact remains, it was us that destroyed your clock. Therefore... Yes, but that's... Either way, I think it's clear at least part of the blame lies with us. It's only fair, then, that we destroy this Annihilator. Agreed? You for real? I'd be up for a little detour. Same here. He did offer us shelter. That creates an obligation. No way around. Someone here needs to keep friends in line. Count Riku in. If plan on fighting, we'll need first-rate chef too. Oh. And that's it. No looking back. Well, my de facto partner's running full steam ahead. I mean, I can't very well go backwards. Can I now? Oh, fine. Go on, then. You wouldn't make it far inside the castle without a proper healer anyway. Uni. Thanks, guys. You're the best. I'll head back to Colony 4, in case the shit hits the fan. Good luck, then, to all of you. Yeah, we'll be all right. Remember, we're up against the castle. Get too close, and we may come under fire. What's our plan? I think we'll be able to manage, as long as we're careful. Come to think of it, you used to go to the castle for offseer training once a year, right, Noah? The Black Fog. Is there much there? There's actually quite a bit. Around this time, the whole area is shrouded in it. They couldn't find us in that cave in Neil Valley, right? And you think we can repeat that? Maybe. Using the fog to approach is clever, but risky. What if an annihilation event occurs? You know... I hadn't really given it much thought up until you mentioned it, but oddly, it hasn't been happening. Seriously? I'm not sure why. Behind the castle, there's an ether deposit being mined in an area facing a lake. 
The ether being obtained there is then delivered into the castle through a freight entrance. So that's where we'll get our sneak on. There won't be anyone in the containers. If we can just get to them, without being spotted... Then we can get into the castle. Okay, let's assume we do give the guards the slip. What do we do once we're inside the place? Tyon, the sensors. What was the Colony 4 soldier's search radius with the fog out? Their scanning range... I'd put in the ballpark of 15 metri. Look here. In the reserve area, there's a maintenance hatch that leads directly to the outer wall. If we make it through here and get to the main housing, it'll land us in front of the Annihilator. Less chance of being spotted by troops outside, too. We can do this. There's one concern. The castle is the Queen's residence. What if we're found by the consuls? Then I guess we'll have a fight on our hands. But it's not like we don't have a retreat. Here. In Keves, after a homecoming, they wash away the belongings of the dead as part of a ritual. It's an understated affair. And the channel they use for it is here. It flows straight out, connecting to the lake outside the castle. I see. So we open a hatch near the Annihilator, ride the current, and we should come out right at the lake. More snuffy in water. Every time we run, why do we always end up getting drenched? I mean, feathers are a bitch to dry. Every time being our grand total of once. Well, let's just hope we don't have to fight. That's the ideal case. That's it, then. Hmm. Ready whatever supplies you need. Then we can go. Something so valuable here. Is there a good use for that? 